Today's video is sponsored by War Thunder, laser-induced plasma channel. Also known as the electrolaser, the laser-induced plasma channel is a very advanced weapon that uses a laser to create a plasma channel in the air, allowing lightning to be directed toward targets. By ionizing the air along its path, the laser enables electrical discharges to strike precisely, delivering lethal force without traditional munitions. Vomit Gun in the movie Minority Report, the police had six sticks that induced instant vomiting upon contact, and now, a similar real-world gun exists. In 2007, the U.S. Navy funded a real-life vomit gun designed by Invicon, which uses radio frequencies to interfere with inner ear balance, causing immediate motion sickness and vomiting. Homeland Security also collaborated with Intelligent Optical Systems to create the LED Incapacitator Gun. This device shoots a pulsing light pattern that can cause nausea, headaches, and disorientation, basically like a flashbang gun. Both weapons aim to safely disable targets. Precision Guided Firearm Precision guided firearms enable soldiers, even with limited training, to achieve high levels of accuracy that typically require years of experience. These weapons analyze data from sensors that read wind speed, humidity, and range to adjust the bullet's path. The craziest feature is their networking ability. With just a point and pull of the trigger, soldiers can be sure the bullet will stay on course. Smart Bullets Smart bullets are engineered to adjust their trajectory in real time, allowing them to follow a moving target like a laser-guided missile, go around barriers, and even make small corrections up to 30 times per second. These bullets can reach targets up to a mile away, making them perfect against fast-moving vehicles or targets hiding behind obstacles. However, each bullet requires complicated technology, which increases their production costs significantly since a soldier fires hundreds of bullets but uses only a few guns. Taser Shockwave the Taser Shockwave system is a unique, wide-area stun gun array designed for crowd control rather than targeting precise points. It has multiple Taser devices wired together and fired from a launcher, allowing powerful shocks to spread over a large area. It can be mounted on various vehicles or structures for police or military use, particularly in non-combat zones like riots, where controlling crowds without lethal force is essential. Heckler and Coke P11 the Heckler and Coke P11 underwater pistol is created to be effective at depths where traditional guns are basically useless. This unique firearm fires steel darts instead of bullets, using a battery-powered electric system to launch them through water, whereas regular bullets lose power quickly after just a couple of meters. It uses five barrels instead of the typical six. Despite its impressive design, the P11 cannot be reloaded and must be sent to the factory for a recharge. Its design is also classified, and details are kept highly confidential. Magnetic Railgun Unlike conventional guns that rely on gunpowder, the magnetic railgun uses electromagnetic fields to propel projectiles at speeds up to 5,600 miles per hour. This prototype railgun delivers so much power and accuracy that it even surpasses traditional heavy artillery, with impact force comparable to that of a cruise missile. The energy required for each shot is huge, and the gun's recoil is very powerful. If you're watching this video, you probably like military-related topics, which is why I'm glad to announce that this video is sponsored by War Thunder. It's the best vehicle combat game ever made, and it's free for PC, consoles, and even mobile devices. You can take command of over 2,500 tanks, planes, helicopters, and ships of 10 major nations, ranging from biplanes and armored cars of the 1920s to the fighter jets and main battle tanks of today. The vehicles are incredibly realistic and detailed, and the incredible graphics and audio make you feel like you're really in there. To be honest, there's such a huge amount of high-quality content to discover that I'd say it's the best game for fans of military history. One of my favorite features is the X-ray view. You can see precisely where the shell penetrated, which components were affected, and what ultimately led to the destruction of the vehicle. It's a breathtaking experience with over 70 million players enjoying epic PvP battles, and you can join them for free on PC, PlayStation, Xbox, and mobile. You can sign up using my links in the description or in the pinned comment. If you've never played before, or you haven't played for at least six months, and you're on PC or console, then when you sign up using my link, you'll get a massive bonus pack with multiple premium vehicles, an exclusive vehicle decorator called the Eagle of Valor, 100,000 Silver Lions, and seven days of premium account. However, this bonus is available only for a limited time, so you have to be quick. Thanks to War Thunder for sponsoring this video. Phaser. 
The Phaser, which is considered to be one of the most futuristic-looking weapons, is a powerful laser dazzler created by the United States Air Force's Research Division. It's particular because it doesn't fire bullets, but it emits an intense and sudden flash of light that can disorient and blind an entire group of enemies within seconds. However, since it's a low-intensity laser, the victims should recover quickly, being stunned for the short period of time needed to shoot them. It's not yet widely used because there were worries that it could be too effective, since blinding weapons that can cause permanent damage were banned under a 1995 UN protocol, being considered a crime against humanity. IVS the Integrated Visual Augmentation System, IVS, is a mixed-reality headset developed by Microsoft in collaboration with the United States Army. It gives soldiers night vision, thermal imaging, and augmented reality capabilities. It also shows critical information like maps, real-time positioning, and enemy locations directly onto the soldier's field of vision, like an Iron Man, making them see the data without having to look away from their surroundings. It could be used not only in actual fights, but in training too, since it can simulate complex battlefield scenarios. Quantum Stealth Quantum Stealth, developed by Hyperstealth Biotechnology Corp., is an incredible form of camouflage technology, often called an invisibility cloak. Unlike traditional camouflage, Quantum Stealth uses a very special material that bends light around an object, creating the illusion of invisibility by making whatever is behind the material seem to disappear. Since light is the very thing that allows us to see, this technology makes soldiers pretty much impossible to see. It even conceals the shadow of the soldiers. Essentially, if the detection system uses light, it won't work. The details of the technology are kept secret for now. LAWS Laser Weapon System the laser weapon system, LAWS, is a directed energy weapon that uses high-powered lasers instead of traditional ammunition. Developed by the U.S. Navy, LAWS can target and disable drones, small boats, and other threats with precision, without producing any explosive debris. It operates silently and can be adjusted to deliver non-lethal effects. The versatility, speed, and cost-effectiveness of LAWS make it a good option for naval defense, with each shot costing less than a dollar, in contrast to missiles or bullets. Active Denial System, ADS the Active Denial System, ADS, also known as a heat ray, is a non-lethal crowd control weapon that emits high-frequency microwaves, causing an intense burning sensation on the skin of targets. Developed by the U.S. military, ADS can control people without causing long-term harm, as the heat only penetrates a few millimeters into the skin. However, due to its painful effects, there are ethical concerns and limited public use. Modular Advanced Armed Robotic System The MARES is a military robot designed for both surveillance and combat, armed with weapons such as machine guns, grenade launchers, and cameras. Controlled remotely, MARES can patrol hostile environments, disarm explosive devices, and even engage in firefights, reducing the need to send soldiers into dangerous areas. This robust system also allows operators to customize it with different weapons and tools depending on mission requirements. Robot Dogs Robotic dogs, often resembling the mechanical K9s created by Boston Dynamics, are four-legged robots designed to maneuver through rough terrain, climb stairs, and operate on their own or under remote control. Though originally developed for search and rescue and civilians, these robot dogs are now being equipped with cameras, sensors, and, in some cases, weapons for military use. Magneto Hydrodynamic Explosive Munition Developed by DARPA, this weapon uses magnetic fields to launch molten metal at targets, replacing traditional explosives. This allows for extremely powerful attacks on armored vehicles, as the molten metal can easily penetrate through thick armor. Talos Tactical Assault Light Operator Suit is a futuristic exoskeleton for combat zones. Named the Iron Man Suit by the Pentagon, Talos boosts a soldier's strength, shields against bullets, monitors vital signs, and enables night vision. There are even plans for future versions to use liquid metal that hardens on command, giving them even stronger protection. Robofly Robofly is a bug-like robot developed by the University of California. It's a tiny flying robot that looks like an insect and is designed for spying missions. The robot acts and copies the flight patterns of real flies, making it hard to detect. Its lightweight structure and design allow it to navigate through tight spaces, just like a normal insect, making it extremely useful for gathering intelligence in places where traditional drones can't go. Flying Humvee the Flying Humvee is a new kind of vehicle that combines a tough armored car with the ability to fly. It is being developed by the U.S. military to give soldiers better transportation options during missions, as this vehicle can take off and land vertically, which means it can avoid obstacles like rivers or mountains. The design includes advanced rotors that help it fly, making it useful for traveling in tight spaces, like in cities or rugged areas. Again. 
Thank you to War Thunder for sponsoring this video. Don't forget to play it for free on PC, PlayStation, Xbox, or mobile by using my links in the pinned comment or video description. Remember, new and returning players that haven't played in six months will receive a massive bonus pack across PC and consoles, including multiple premium vehicles and other goodies. It's available for a limited time only, though, so make sure not to miss it.